back, back of your mind kind of pigeonhole how they're going to fit in come pre season you're going to get just wait until you actually get them on the practice field before you start making decisions like that. I've got an idea of how, how we'll play it, but um, you never can tell to how, how camp camp goes, how these guys come back from from their injuries. Some of the guys have kind of uh, talked about how maybe you've talked to them about uh, maybe taking more ownership of the offense. You know, obviously they've been a, a young uh, offensive line the last couple of years, and now these guys are kind of growing up. And, uh, do you want them to take more responsibility for you know, whether this is a, a championship type type team on offense? Well, you, you always want your line to be be leaders uh, in, in your offense. You know, when Bubba Fernando Velasco was a senior, he was a he's, he's a great leader. He's he's the best leader, one of the best leaders we've had on our team since I've been here. Uh, you like guys that step up and be that way and, and, and be leaders by example and being vocal and. And the older these kids get, the more experience they get, they should take on more of the leadership role. Are you start seeing one of the young guys kind of maybe start to grow into that role yet? Or is that stuff? I think they are. I think they are. They, they, like I said, they've worked hard this spring. They, uh, they haven't missed practice. The ones that you know started, they, they've stayed healthy. They haven't missed any reps. Uh, and I think they've gotten better. Any adjustment? Going from Matthew as a starting quarterback for the last two and a half years uh, to Joe in terms of, uh, I guess, Joe might not be as mobile, I'm not exactly sure, but uh, is there anything from an offensive line standpoint, you know, switching over? No, we're going to teach it up, up front. Uh, we're going to teach the same way we've always taught. Uh, you know, Stafford was a great quarterback. I, 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 I intend on Joe being a great quarterback for us. He's doing a great job this spring leading. Mm -hmm. and, uh, but offensively up front, we want, to be, we want to do a better job of protecting and being able to run the ball effectively. How much you appreciate what a guy like Fred Munson and I has done? I mean, fullback got some snaps and tailback. It kind of fits in that tough guy mode. You know? Fred, Fred's come on and done a good job this, this spring and uh, run the ball hard when he's got his chances in the scrimmages. And uh, I like what I see out of Fred. Thank you, Coach. All right. Hey, Coach, I interviewed Caleb uh, a couple weeks ago, and I was kind of asking him what – what, what your new title meant to him, and uh, he 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 didn't say much, but he did say that uh, he hit the wrong hole one time, and you were in his ear hole a little. Is that? I mean, ha have you kind of? Well, you know that that really hasn't changed. You know, I uh, we all, you know, they're all our guys. Uh, if B Max sees something or Bobo sees something up front, they say it, and if I see something with a back. You know, we're going we're gonna to try to correct them and help them out and be the best they can be. So that, that hasn't changed. With, with as much depth as you're hopefully going to have going into next year, are, are you looking forward to those short yardage situations where uh, we can get to a point where, hey, we're going to get that yard and we know it? You always want that. You know, you like to stay out of short yardage situations. But you, you want to you be confident in your office line and your backs so they can get the tough yards. And when you say the lack of depth has made that hard, I mean? It has been hard. Uh, when you've got young guys who haven't been in the, in the battles, uh, don't have the experience, it, it's tough. And, and now they're getting a little more experience underneath them, under their belts, and hopefully they'll do better every game. Thanks, man.